Good morning guys and welcome to a special little vlog. This is not actually within a vlogging month, but today Mike and I are going to Crufts. I'm so excited, I've never been to Crufts before. As you guys know, we are dog mad. So we're heading to Crufts for the day as part of a special project we're working on. I'm gonna tell you about that whilst we're in the car because we have to go, we're a little bit late. But there's one problem with going to Crufts. We have the most monstrous dogs in the world. <laughs> We're only allowed to take one dog. And let me tell you now, the dog that everyone wanted to go, Piglet Wiglet, but why are you not going Pig? Because you're too naughty and you will bark at all of the other dogs. So, little Miss Teacher's pet over here, Squidge, She's like, I'm off, come on, we're going. Chop, chop. Crafts time. And in case you're wondering, we're not taking Treacle because she is a little bit nervous. I think she'd be okay, but I definitely don't think she'd deal with it as well as Squidge, who is very, very sociable. So off we go to Crafts. You guys get treats for staying and being good. Yes. My mom's coming to look after them in a bit. We're on our way, we're heading to the Birmingham NEC, which is where Crafts is held. I've never been before, I'm so excited. I always used to watch Crafts on the TV when I was younger. So Squidjo is bumbled up in the back somewhere. Squidge! Squidgy. Hello! <laughs> there she is. Oh, How are you doing my love? She knows something's going on. She doesn't know where on earth she's going, which she's been excited all morning. So we gave her a shampoo and dried her so she's all soft and clean and we put her collar on. So she knows that something special is happening, but she doesn't know what yet. And she's so, on her own. So. And she's on her own, which makes her feel extra special because Squidge is the teacher's pet of our dogs. She just loves all the attention on her. She's so funny. But basically, why are we going to Crofts for the first time ever? So we got asked by Bayer to be part of the Be Lungworm Aware campaign, which if you guys don't know what lungworm is, I'll explain a bit about it because if you have dogs, then you should know what it is because um, it can be a real risk to um, their health. Basically, it's a parasite that is carried by slugs and snails. Um, and if a dog kind of eats the slug or the snail that is carrying the larvae of this parasite, they can get lungworm or even it can be transferred in puddles, wherever a snail or a slug has been basically. So it's really snail important trail. that wherever the snail trail has been. It can be really, really bad for your dogs. It even causes death a lot of the time. So you have to be really careful and know the kind of signs and symptoms and just be aware of it if your dogs spend a lot of time in areas where there are slugs and snails especially. Some of the early symptoms as well if your dog does get it are a cough um, and to be really lethargic. So it's definitely worth, if you're a dog owner, to be wary of lungworm and protect your dogs against lungworm and kind of like know the risks. It's something we've been really more so conscious of since we lost Woof. If you guys have been watching for a long time, you'll remember Woof. She was our first dog and we actually lost her three years ago. Um, and we didn't lose her to lungworm, we lost her to something else, which you guys will know about if you've been watching for a long time. And it was really sad and it, you know, it was, it was horrible to be honest. She was only four. And ever since then it's made us so aware of kind of our dog's health and making sure that our dogs are protected from things that are unnecessary kind of dangers to their health and stuff like that. So they do actually have an interactive map where you can put your postcode in and it shows you if there have been any animals that have had lungworm in your area so you can know if it is um, a high risk area as well. So I'm gonna pop a link below so you guys can go check that out. But let's go, let's see what we find at Crafts, see how many cute dogs we can spot. And I'm hoping Squidge behaves herself and doesn't do a big steaming pile of poo in the middle of Crofts. She has made sure she has done her poo <laughs> We have poo bags, but it's still always a worry, is it not? <laughs> Here we are, Squidge. Are you ready? <laughs> she does not know where she is. Squidge just made her first friend in the park outside, so I'm hoping she's going to be good. We've just arrived at the Lungworm Stamp, and Squidge is being a good girl. She's got her water. There's also a tree inside. It's amazing. Um, and we're just going to meet a couple of people, say hi, take some pictures, take some doggy selfies, hey? And then we're going to go on an adventure. trying to fix the uh, the lungworm snails. Oh, she, oh my god, she doesn't mind! No. Yes, please! I think she's not realised oh, what's going on right now. <laughs> so 
Cute. Look at the sign, guys. That looks so much like treacle. I would even think it was treacle. I've also just discovered another sign that has piglet on it. That could be piglet. I feel like. Mike, they're taking pictures of our dogs and putting them on adverts. I think it could be happening right now. We're in the Discover Dog section where they basically have like every single kind of breed of dog. What? How do you say that? Kucha Hunja. <laughs> they're so cute, look at them all. Squidge, you're the worst groomed dog here. <laughs> Squidge's walking the pink carpet. We're in the Spaniel section. There's Irish Water Spaniels, Sussex Spaniels, Welsh Springer Spaniels. Where's the English Springer Spaniels? <laughs> I know! Welsh ones are really cute, look. Hey guys! Aww. Hello! This is Squidge getting all the attention. <laughs> These guys are called Musterlanders. Look how beautiful you are! Um, They're like a giant treacle. We're now heading over to the Dachshund area. I can see it! There's a whole row of Dachshunds. There's miniature wire, wire, miniature smooth, smooth, Miniature long haired and long haired, and I think Mike may well be in here already. I'm in Dachshund heaven right now, guys. I want to buy one five. <laughs> Look at these guys! Oh. Look who I found! So cute! Hello! These guys are little wire haired miniature Dachshund. We're currently looking for new dog beds for you, aren't we, Squidgy? What, do you what think? about these snuggly ones? Does that look yeah? comfy? Comfy? <laughs> hmm? <laughs> She'll so, get it. So I think about it. <laughs> Squidge. Yeah. Oh, Squidge. Oh. I mean, I think we've got a winner. A little bit embarrassing. A winner. Oh, she's on again. <laughs> she's back on. Squidge is getting a little bit tempted by the dog food stand. Yeah. Uh oh. oh. <laughs> now this we need. Yes. Yes. No. Yes. Squidge. Yes. Pink hair. No. No. <laughs> and I thought Piglet was a princess. <laughs> There's a long way to go, I better not show that to Piglet. Don't show that to Piglet. <laughs> Someone is a little bit spoiled, we're coming away with two beds. Squidge is so excited. Winner. We Squid went to pick them up, she was literally jumping on them. Someone's very happy with her new bed. <laughs> <laughs> Someone's bed is taking up the whole boot of the car. Are you a happy girl, Squidge? Did you have a good day? You were so good. You were so yeah, good. Yeah, this it. bed looks so cozy. Good girl, Squidgy. Okay. We're on our way home. We had the best afternoon at Crofts. I definitely want to go next year. It was so fun. And Squidge was so good. Did you have a good time? A delightful time. We saw so many cute dogs. We're now on our way home to see the other pooches and give them a quick snuggle before I head off to London tonight. I'm going back to London because I have the Glamour Beauty Festival tomorrow. So exciting weekend. So it looks like this bed is going down a treat. <laughs> they are all very excited about it. Is it Snuggly Pig? Is it better than this stinky old one? Oh, yes. <laughs> You can all sleep in there as well, it's Hello, ginormous. Hello little one, we missed you at Crufts. We did, you would have barked the house down. Hello, hello. We actually got them two beds. So we got that big one that we showed you and we also got one to replace this because this bed we've had for almost three years and it's just really disgusting. Like it actually doesn't look too bad on camera but it's really, gross and dirty so we also got another one of these like a flat one hello piggy wig look at that guys it's not the perfect fit but it looks pretty damn cozy to me oh guys yes oh yeah so that's probably gonna be it for the vlog today guys i'm heading back to London now. Squidge is exhausted as well. I just busted her snoozing upstairs on our bed. <laughs> Cheeky little monkey. But we had the best time, so a massive thank you to the whole Be Long I'm Aware team for inviting us along. We had a really fun day, and I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Thank you so much as well to everybody who stopped us when we were there. It was so nice to see you all and meet lots of people, especially so the dogs. We met some seriously cute little dogs. And yeah, I hope you guys have a great day. I'll be back vlogging on this channel every day in April. I might try and make another video before then for you guys so watch this space on here. But I have some really exciting things planned for April that I can't wait to share with you guys. I'll see you again soon. And if you want more updates in between vlogs, then make sure you go and follow me on Snapchat. See you soon, guys. Bye.